Welcome back to The Roundtable. I'm your host, Osric Vox, and what time is it? Feelings of despair and sadness time. Yeah, this isn't going to be that much of a happy little news video. Earlier in the year, towards the end of Regular Show's run on Cartoon Network, I made a series of videos under the moniker of Cartoon Network Hates Regular Show. In that series, I touched on how utterly disrespectful Cartoon Network has been towards the show. They barely reran it, only a few commercials circulating, and when finale time came, they abandoned their tradition of doing a marathon of said series for such an event in favor of a marathon for Teen Times Go. I don't even have anything against Tea Times Go, but marathoning a different series before the finale of another that's regarded as a key player in redeeming Cartoon Network many years ago is just wrong. After a regular show's finale, the series has not appeared once on the network schedule. No reruns or anything. It's been completely absent from the channel since January. You think that's pretty bad, right? Well, it's nothing compared to how they're treating the final season of Adventure Time. That's right, Adventure Time is actually in its final season, and not only that, it already began airing. Some of you may already be aware of this, I was, but here's the thing, they didn't throw the season premiere on their Friday night premiere block. That makes the most sense, right? Fit it in somewhere of Teen Titans Go, OKKO, OK We Bear Bears, all of those shows. Kids will already be tuning in, so why not? Well, the scheduling department's solution was to air not just a season premiere, but four whole episodes, almost an entire bomb's worth, and one fell swoop on a Sunday evening. Well, okay, some channels have Sunday premieres. Let's look at Fox, for example. They can make it work, right? Haha, <laughs> they don't want to make it work because these episodes weren't even advertised. This is arguably worse than regular show because at least the final season was not only advertised, but branded as its own special miniseries, regular show in space. They also pushed the finale quite a bit. Commercials for it aired pretty frequently. I know, it's absolutely ludicrous. Why on earth would they do this? Regular Show and Adventure Time have both had dwindling ratings throughout the run. Even now, Adventure Time doesn't do so hot. The Islands miniseries had below average ratings, and even though it wasn't advertised, it was fresh off the heels of Steven Bomb 6, airing immediately after each episode. Yet, I still don't think Adventure Time deserves this fate. Okay, little to no reruns for a show that doesn't do too well makes sense. But premiering multiple episodes in one sitting without advertisement on a Sunday? Any other show, I probably wouldn't blink. The Powerpuff Girls reboot only airs when it's a premiere on Sunday afternoon as well. I could give less than a damn. But this is adventure time! This show means a lot to the fans of the network, as they heavily associate it more than any other show for its renaissance in 2010. This show revolutionized Cartoon Network for the new age, alongside regular show. It was one of the first non-anime, non-live action, non-film programming on the network to have a TV PG rating, to push the boundaries of what can and can't be done or said on children's television. Even though I haven't been caught up on Adventure Time in quite a while, I'm heartbroken over Cartoon Network's treatment of the series lately. Never in a million years would I have expected this series to be on life support, barely clinging on. Hell, every time I walk into Hot Topic, yes, I shop there unironically, I always see a new Adventure Time shirt. So you would imagine the series is still profitable in some way. Overall, I really hope Cartoon Network has a change of heart and begins to advertise the series before it reaches its climax. We are in the show's endgame. It's now or never, and you already know once it's over, there won't be any reruns. Let's have the series go out with one last hurrah. But as always, these are just my thoughts, and I'd love to hear yours. So please, let's get the discussion going in the comment section below. Are you saddened by Cartoon Network's treatment of Adventure Time? Do you agree that yes, it deserves better? And if you want the discussion going beyond the comments, you can follow and tweet to us at RoundTableVids and me at AustricVox. You can also join our community Discord or download the Roundtable Amino app. And if you're feeling generous, consider supporting us on Patreon for a dollar. Links to all those in the description. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please order a like, and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. It really helps us out. I hope you have a beautiful day, and Ostrich Vox, signing out. This video has been powered by Patreon. If you want to give us some more support, head to patreon.com slash roundtablevids, become a patron, and get some awesome perks. Thanks for watching another video on the Roundtable. If you want to get more involved with our community and watch videos from Let's Talk with Tom, Voxbox, and more, click the video right here. Or if you want to get some more of the animation goodness, watch some Crystal Clear or Mini Monday, Click the video right here, and please don't forget to subscribe.